I grew up in the east side of Orlando, the city, Inglewood neighborhood, where there was nothing for our youth. It was an underprivileged neighborhood, for lack of a better description. And at the time, there was a small building, 40 by 20, where the boys club was located. Eventually, they moved to another facility that became the Boys and Girls Club in partnership with the city of Orlando. But at the time, we did not have a lot to entertain ourselves or participate in sports, this, that, and the other. To be honest, if it had not been for the Boys and Girls Club, I would not be in the position that I am in today. Inner city children, unfortunately, are hindered sometimes because of their financial situation from participating in ideal programs that maybe other kids take for granted. I happen to be one of the kids from my neighborhood, along with a very good friend of mine, Charlie Perez, who was selected as a candidate for the Boy of the Year to meet the President of the United States. Charlie Perez was selected for that role, but to be able to participate in that process and actually be given the tools necessary to compete for something like that, it allows you to learn so much about so many different things that eventually prepares you for a better future. It is very important for children to have a safe haven to go to after school and during the summer. Boredom, sometimes leads you into a path or towards a path that unfortunately is also surrounded by negative activity. It, it's up to you to be involved in sports, to be involved in community engagement projects, to be involved in leadership roles within the organization itself. All of that encompasses the Boys and Girls Club structure. So for our youth to have that luxury, to be able to be part of such a given program, it's really truly a blessing for our youth. Not only did they make us feel welcome, they also provided that mentoring, provided that setting to come back for more. It was never, hey, I don't know if I want to go to the Boys and Girls Club today. It was more like, I can't wait until tomorrow when they open up the place again so that I can continue to absorb that experience that the Boys and Girls Club provides.